Hey guys, uh, this is Mr. Barthol, and uh, this video is another force. It's just with two again, and I kind of made this. If y'all want to practice on your own, you can use these two forces, and um, you can go ahead and try to do it on your own right now. Pause the video, and I'll give you all a few seconds to pause it, and I'm going to go over it so you can check your work. So go ahead and pause the video, and now that you've done the problem. I'm going to go over it real quick so you can check to make sure that you did it correct. So our two forces, 40 newtons at 83 degrees, 75 newtons at 190 degrees. So our first step, which we talked about in the last video, was to determine a scale. So how are we going to scale our vectors? One centimeter equals blank newtons. Um, in this case, you know, if we use 1 equals 1, like the last one, we'd have to draw a 40 centimeter line. That's, that's uh, pretty, pretty long. Don't want to quite do that. Um, a, good, a good one to use for this is 10. 1 centimeter equals 10 newtons. You see this one is 40, this one is 70, so the numbers are, are um, they're not exact multiples of 10, but you, I mean, you, hopefully when you all did this, you saw that if the scale is 10, this one is 40, so this has to be 4 centimeters, because 4 times 10 equals 40. And this one has to be 7.5 centimeters, since 7.5 times 10 equals 75. So um, I'm going to go ahead and draw my, uh, my dot to start off with, and measure the first angle out, lining up our protractor. Make sure this is nice and neat. We have... 83 degrees, excuse me, 83, 1, 2, 3, right there, and 40 newtons. So this is going to be 4 centimeters. All right, so from the end of this one, we measure our second one. So, excuse me, let me label this F1 equals... This is 4 centimeters long, which represents 40 newtons. So now from this, 190 degrees. Uh-oh, protractor only goes to 180. So um, I did a video on that. So basically, we flip our protractor around. 180 is on the left. We add 10 more degrees to make 190. And is that lined up? Yeah, that's right. So 190. And we are going to, there's our little dot, measure out, has to be 75 newtons, so 7.5 centimeters, which is right here. So this is F2 equals uh, 7.5 centimeters, which is 75 newtons. So now that we're done with all of our vectors that we're adding, we're going to draw our net force. Remember, our net force goes from our dot to the end of the last vector. It's like a journey. We started here, we went up here, went this way. Now we're done, so we started from the dot. Our total journey was starting here and, uh, and ending here. So this is our net force. And measuring that out, it turns out to be 7 point call that 7.3, 7.3, 7.4. Remember, I'm gonna, whenever I'm checking these, I'm gonna give you, you know, plus or minus 10%. Um, 7.3, 7, so we'll call that 7.3 centimeters. And uh, so, we're not quite done. We have found our net force, but we need to know, again, this, uh, this the, the direction and the magnitude of our net force. So our scale was 10 newtons. So 7.3 centimeters times 10 newton for every centimeter. So our net force is 73 newtons at an angle of 160, right on the dot. So 160 degrees. And so, like I said, I'm, you know, mine might not be exactly perfect. Yours might not be exactly perfect. So if I would accept an answer, um, plus or minus 10%. So if you had anything um, between 65 and 80, 
one, give you give you eleven percent. And eighty one newtons, then you are okay. And if you had anything between one hundred and forty four through one hundred and seventy six degrees, then you you will be okay as well. So it's actually a fairly wide range. So um, the closer you are, the closer you were to this, obviously the better that the better that you did it. So I would encourage you to do it again um, to make sure that you are as precise as possible. If you weren't, uh, you know, if you were farther away from these as possible, or farther away than you should have been, I should say. So uh, that's it for this problem. The next one I'm going to do is to do with three vectors. Um, I'm running out of time on this one, sort of, and so I'm going to make it on a third video, or another video. And I hope you got something out of this, and take care.